VS Code is a productivity tool, but it doesn't mean you can't have fun. So here's five things that you can do with code and Visual Studio code just for fun. Do you guys remember the bracket programming language I showed you? Well, here's a quick reminder of what the Hello World script looked like for that language. And it got me thinking. I looked into these types of languages and found out that they're actually called esoteric programming languages. They're meant to push the boundaries of programming language design. So I was going to show you guys one called Whitespace, but it was a little underwhelming. So this is what I found. This crazy language is called Bafunch, and the Hello World script here is legitimately pushing P onto the stack and uses arrow symbols to move the instruction pointer around until it hits an instruction like the at symbol to end the program. You guys should go check it out, especially because there's this Bafunch extension in the marketplace that adds syntax highlighting and alignment and guides for the language in VS Code. So yeah, have fun. Try lol code. Okay. So lol code is another esoteric programming language inspired by lol speak. It's for cats. Okay, I get it now. I think I know exactly who is going to be best suited for this job. I'm going to go get them. Hey. Can you help me with something? A few moments later. So with some help from a friend, we put together this Hello World script. And this is what lol code looks like. If you can tell, there's even syntax highlighting for the language that you can get with the cool extension in the marketplace right here. Lol code. Go check it out. Enable code transparency with Classit. Let's check that out. So it's actually called Glasset, bit of a typo there, glass like glass windows. And then when you press Control Alt Z, it increases the transparency of VS Code, it makes the window a little bit transparent. You can see there with the background coming through. Now to get back, you press Control Alt C, which decreases transparency. I should note that there is no end to the transparency. So we can just press this over and over and over again, and the window will eventually become completely invisible, which seems like a good way to prank coworkers. So if you go back to your desk and your VS Code is just gone, just try pressing Control-Alt-C a bunch of times because maybe somebody has pranked you with the Glasset extension. If you want to look cool coding, install this power mode extension. It doesn't do much, but it makes you look good by using all these effects. Watch this. This is amazing. That's pretty cool. And you could change the effect by going into settings. Let's say I want to change it from particles to fireworks. Come over here, type in some function. It looks like I am a superhero coding. Awesome update user and what is the purpose of that counter 6670 x nobody knows but it looks good if you're a developer and not using the vs code pets extension what are you doing this extension lets you have a pet code right along with you my dog loves vs code and now i can throw a ball with him in my editor there's so many pets you can add a cat a rubber duck clippy even a snake for you python devs this is the cutest thing ever. 